fellow hippie chicsters. So today I'm going to do my first ever what's in my daily makeup drawer. Um, what I use every day when I put on my makeup um, and how I store it and organize it. So I really do hope that you enjoy it. Um, also, I'm filming on my phone camera today, which I think is going to turn out better than most of my videos. And my um, stepdad got me, or us, a special little light, which you can't really see in the video, um, to start doing better lighting. He's going to start his own YouTube channel soon, and once I have his name and information, I will also put that down below in all my videos so you guys can start looking at his. Um, so I hope you enjoy it. And we're gonna get started okay okay so okay so this is my makeup drawer this is how I organize it um, and what I use every day when I apply my makeup um, I bought these containers at the dollar store um, I believe these were three for a dollar these were two for a dollar and these were also two for a dollar at the dollar store um, you can get them in a variety of colors my favorite color is blue so that's why I picked out my blue ones so we can start so the first basket we're going to start with is this one. This is my basket where I put my monthly subscription um, items that I really like and want to use for the week or for the month depending on how often I want to change it out. So right now um, for my lip monthly bag for August, I really like this, um, let me turn that around, City Color Be Matte Lipstick and it's in this really pretty shade of pink and it is called Phoebe, which my phone camera doesn't focus as well and then I really like this um, lid last shadow pen in gilded mink it's a really pretty brown and I love putting it in the crease of my eyes so that's also my favorite right now from Ipsy I really enjoy my J Cat flying solo in half naked um, eyeshadow which I put on the lid of my eyes every day so far and then I also really like this Urban Decay Perversion. Let's put it in the lights a little better. There you go. Um, mascara. I really wish it was a bigger size instead of a sample size, but I really do enjoy it. So I'm definitely going to buy the full size soon. <clears throat> Behind it are my makeup brushes. And I use Motives, Real Techniques, Mark from Avon. And then I believe we just got these zebra print ones at like... Probably Walmart which they work really well and they're my favorite um, animal stripes or animal whatever um, too and so I use those I also have if you go up here we made my own little makeup brush holder and so I also have my eco tools up there as well um, next to these two baskets are my cotton pads which I use them to kind of like dab my Powder. Sometimes I use them just to wipe off makeup. Um, I put my toner on them to put on my face. The basket next to it just has all my tools. It has my eyelash curlers, my tweezers, my eyelash glue, my pencil sharpener. And then this thing is so freaking cool. Um, it is a spring, like a tweezer, and it's you roll it across your face and it will start to pull all the little hairs out. Um, it definitely hurts, but it's definitely super worth it because your face is super smooth like a baby um I got this on Amazon for like a dollar eighty eight I've seen them at Walgreens and like CVS for like five dollars um I definitely think Amazon was a better deal the only thing that sucks was it took like three weeks to get it because it came from China um other than that I really like it I learned about this on KL's um Secret Life of a Bio Nerd she did a maintenance day video which I'll link that down below as well for you guys and I really enjoyed the video because it definitely like showed like a different way of getting yourself ready and keeping yourself like maintenance and beautified. Um, so that's this, which definitely is worth it. Dollar eighty eight from Amazon, three weeks. Eh, takes a little time, but it's still worth it. Um, next to it, I have my baby wipes. I don't use these to wipe off my makeup, but when I'm doing my makeup and I use my fingers or the back of my hands, I use them just to wipe off my hands so that they're clean, so I can apply the next part of my makeup. Back here, we'll pull out, out a little more. This is my Sephora Eye Palette. Um, these are the colors that I mostly use, and you can tell the ones that have the most dents in them are the ones that I use the most. Um, I got this for Christmas a few years ago from my mom, and so I kind of worked through my entire like 
Christmas makeup box that she bought me, and this is all I have left. Um, we'll start with this basket on this side now, and so this holds my BB cream, my um, Motives Face Perfecting Primer, my e.l.f. Um, highlight and Concealer, my e.l.f. Um, makeup Mist and Setting Spray, um, my Boo Boo Cover Up Camouflage Concealer, which I really love. I got this in the May Ipsy bag. And I totally love it. My Wet n Wild um, white eyeline pencil. My Rimmel London Scandalize Cool Charcoal Black Eyeliner, which I'm not even showing you yet. My Physician's Formula Felt Tip Eye Definer Eyeliner. My NYSC Showtime Glitter Eyeliner in Paparazzi Purple I use on a daily basis. Um, my EOS um, Lip Balm. It's my favorite um, color and smell. and It's just my favorite lip balm in general. I have that every day. And then pairing my lipstick um, from City Color right now, I've been doing my NYX Butter Gloss in... Eclair um, as well and so that's in there and then these are my <clears throat> bronzers and eyeshadows that I mostly use on a daily basis um, I use my Pacifica um, little palette thing or sample from my Ipsy bag I use the white pretty much only I do not like how the purple comes out the purple comes out and it looks even like in this um, light it comes out that color, that gray color, and I'm not really a big fan of it. I really love the white, though. I love that it shimmers, and it's really beautiful. Um, I use it to highlight my brow bone and the inner eyes, um, inner crease or whatever, my eyes. Um, then I use my Pop Bronzer, which I just got in July Zipsy Bag. Um, and this is in Sun or Secret Sunshine, and it's Sun Kissed Bronzer. I use it every day. Um, I use it to contour mostly, um, but I really love it. It's an amazing product that I've gotten. Um, so I'm really into Motives right now too. So Motives, this is my face powder. So after I put on my BB cream or my um, foundation, I cover it and set it with my Motives powder. This is my Motives blush, which my sister picked it out the color out for me really. Um, because I'm not really into super, super red pigmented um, blushes, and I'm not into brown, and I'm not into just full-on pink. Um, I like kind of a mixture, and so she mixed these those three colors together for me, and it made this really, like, I call it suede um, color, and it's, like, really pretty, and it comes on really nice, and it kind of almost looks like a bronzer, just a little bit darker than what I have from Pop. Um... Here I also use my Motives Eye Base, and I put it on my eyelids, and it holds my eyeshadow on very well. And then, and then I have two Motive Eye Palettes that I like to use. This one has my purple and my dark brown, and I used my light cream color all the way up, so I'm all out of it. And then my other one that I love using has this really pretty bronzy gold and these two pretty blues. And I use them on a daily basis when I do my makeup. And so that is what I use every day in my daily makeup drawer. Um, if you like what you see, comment down below and let me know because I can do a makeup tutorial of my everyday makeup routine. Um, and that's it. Bye! Okay, my hippie cheeksters, so I hope you enjoyed that video. Um, comment down below, like I said, and let me know if you want to see an everyday makeup tutorial, as well as um, comment down below if you want to see my full makeup area and have a tour of my office. Um, thumbs up if you like this video. Also, subscribe. And remember, my stepdad will be starting his own YouTube channel soon, and once that happens, I will be letting you guys know all about it and how to watch it as well as I'll be linking down my favorite KL video. 
um, down below. So I hope you enjoyed it. Peace, love, and happiness. Bye.